We could have kissed you, daubed in pearl, boats rocking in the docks, cradled by black water. No crickets sang that night, but there must have been some small orchestra, the way the water murmured, the way the wind blew so softly in the sails of ships, the way the whole world seemed to sway as you held me. We could have kissed you. We could have walked along the river and wondered how many dead bodies are in the Thames at any given time. You could have told me that you wouldn't save me if I fell in because you didn't know how to swim, and we could have sat on the stairs anyway, feet daring the waves from the wall, surrounded by crumbling brick and the snores of fishermen, the wet whip of skipping stones across the water, the gentle thunking of wood on wood as the waves bundled the boats into each other. You could have cut my face between forefinger and thumb, had all of London converge around your mouth, the city melting into wet paint and light. You could have claimed me at the Adelphi, or the South Bank, or Tower Bridge, or on the bar overlooking St. Paul's. You could have pointed north and told me that you thought the Barbican was ugly. We could have talked about architecture and utopia, and I could have made you laugh. I could have made you fall in love in that pearl gray light, with the boats bumping together clumsy like kisses with eyes closed, with the water shimmering and whispering siren calls, with all of London stopping for a minute holding its breath as you lifted my face to yours. Thank you.